Quantum computing, explained by bunnies. Bunny, wake up! Bunny loves carrots, but there is a problem. There are 1,000 tunnels, and only one leads to the carrot vault. He's a classical bunny. He can only try one tunnel at a time. He needs either a lot of time or a bunch of bunnies, but that's too expensive. But now, Bunny becomes a quantum bunny. He enters a superposition, exploring all tunnels at once. Oh look, he is collapsing back, but the answer is fuzzy. Ghost bunnies were all doing different tasks. It's like an orchestra where everyone plays a different song. Let's entangle the bunnies. Now they are connected, forming one big wave of knowledge. Here comes the oracle. It doesn't say where the carrots are, but it marks the right tunnel with a cape, secretly flipping its wave. This way, when the bunnies collapse again, wrong tunnels interfere with each other, and marked bunnies stand out like waves in the water. So quantum bunny is crazy fast, but only if you know how to mark the answers. That's why quantum bunny can't be used to solve open questions, like writing a poem. Can you tell bunny how to mark the best poem? But for certain problems, it's a bunny rocket. Subscribe for more fluffy knowledge.